Namaste. In this tutorial, I will tell you how to plot velocity profile of a viscous fluid in the pipe along the radius. So let's see first of all code in the MATLAB. Okay. Now let's try to understand uh, what are the inputs and what are the outputs and how does it work. So first of all, uh, here, here, uh, here we see the things are pressure. Uh, PA basically pressure at in at inlet pressure at outlet and the units of pressure are in pascals mu that is viscosity uh, and its unit is pascal second r that is radius l that is length and its units are in meter okay so first of all we give the input input basically uh, what do that it will take uh, input from us and before taking input it will show this message so that's how it works uh, PV that is basically pressure at point B uh, that basically means pressure at the exit so it will take the uh, input value of pressure at point B in Pascal similarly mu that is viscosity R and length okay if PA equal to PV then it will show an error a question is why it will show an error uh, we know that here you, can, here you see in our formula the, the formula of V max is absolute PA minus PB. If PA equal to PB, then what will become zero? So we put this condition P equal to PB, then it will show an error because uh, it will just show a single line and not the velocity profile of the graph. So uh, we make this condition. Okay. After that, here n equal to 150 and R line space minus R R n. A question is uh, what is this set? and uh, what uh, what is the requirement of this uh, let me uh, try to understand you by with the use of graph oh, sorry not this one uh, here i enter the value of radius 10 minus 10 to 10 and n is 150 that is basically the scale gap so it means that 10 and minus 10 the gap in between is uh, 150 uh, I guess you still don't get it. So let me tell you by uh, executing this command. Copy this command. Go to MATLAB. Con uh, sorry. Control plus V. No, enter n value 150. R value 10. Minus 10. Now enter it. Here you see that it will automatically generate uh, a column factor from minus 10 to 10, and it uh, it about uh, and it, it is near nearly 150 values. Okay. Uh, okay. After that, now let's see uh, other coding. Now we now we use now our logic that is v absolute pa minus pv to calculate the v maximum velocity. Now here v is v and the, now here we calculating the velocity at uh, along the radius of the pipe for example when r is 10 uh, minus 9 minus 8 so we are taking uh, the row vector so we use dot here as you can see here dot so we are using dot because we want to uh, to calculate the value at uh, row vector that is basically the 150 point as i show you earlier so we basically put dot here now a question arises why use why we use in plotting stem not plot um, by using stem we get the accuracy for example uh, sorry for example if i want uh, these are the values calculated so i can simply see if i use plot command then i didn't know what is the value and it is difficult for me so by using stem command i get i know that this is exactly the point uh, that that comes at the output okay uh, so basically uh, we separate the velocity at different points for example when the radius of the part is uh, uh, radius of the pipe is 8 then what is the velocity so we here we can easily calculate that is this is 8 and this is the velocity so uh, at this so we can easily uh, e so we get the values x label y label uh, etc now pro if, put it, if, uh, if you potential first of all uh, we this uh, we do x c by c that c is equal to zero and we use ellipsoid. Uh, a question is what is ellipsoid? Uh, here you can see what is mean by ellipsoid. You can just simply uh, you know just enter here the value uh, enter the thing counter 
a counter app so just click on it and you will get this pop up help so you can easily understand the meaning the, uh, for example a hey, counter app basically means uh, it basically click uh, it basically create the iso lines so that is uh, so that uh, in this case we use in our uh, isographic similarly this other uh, a question now so what this autumn do so as you see here that this color uh, ye yellow to red this uh, this color map is called autumn so we use autumn okay and this is the color bar yeah you can see here grid on that is basically with these lines that is called basically grid now here we see info one uh, str cat basically it is a string cat uh, string now here we see m u num to string mu p s a question is what is uh, why we do that uh, so here, we, here you see uh, here you see in uh, backslash backslash mu so it basically converts this mu to a standard sigma mu now in second case v max uh, uh, if you look carefully that uh, max is at the bottom of the v so to sh show like this uh, we enter the value like this okay now to give the position of v max uh, mu we use text 0 0.05 that is basically uh, from the center and 0 0.05 the gap horizontal gap and the vertical gap is one from this length to one uh, it's basically unit defined by itself okay simulate as a hold of so basically that to hold the graph okay uh, now let's run this program and see how does it work click on run uh, enter the value a that is 10 enter the value of b 20 enter the viscosity 2.36 you can change as per your requirement enter the radius of the pipe uh, let's change the value 20 enter the length of the pipe uh, let's take it 300 here you see the it plots the graph uh, that is 20 to minus 20 and here it plots the graph fully uh, i hope you understand how does it work and if you have any queries please comment and the and the whole code of this program uh, it will be in description uh, you can copy paste from there and please subscribe so that it motivates us uh, to make better program and uh, to teach you better new things uh, Thanks for watching.